it's very odd to be in a position to present to you the congregation of the saint mattress and if you know our performing arts side well in the church entity versus christianity you might appreciate <laughs> why some of us ended up staying at the congregation at saint mattress and practicing our first speech started about 10 years ago we created a couple programs and one would be the perfect church play, the Congregation of St. Mattress, and I'll show you some images in the next post. But I just want to open this up in prayer, and we're going to share a story that I think all of you are going to really enjoy. Heavenly Father, right now, Lord, that there's been a lot of bad stories out there. But Lord, there's the stories that, well, the lead story. And right now, Lord, that we would tell the story, the bad story, and the lead story. The story that no one gets to hear enough about. The funny side, the backward end of it, the back end of it. Father, I just thank you that there are some really great stories that we don't want to miss that opportunity. Because there's a, the upside and the downside of each story. Like I said, there's this big picture that some of us get of things. Some of them might have a Megatron. Some of them might have a s small image. I don't know where you, where you get your video or how you come across it or how you get to that YouTube channel. I don't know what, how you had to navigate there or what you had to go through to find it. But you need that lead story, that big story, the story that you were hoping you would wait all your all your life for the big story and boom you found the big story and you found us I don't know how you arrived there I don't know what what it took for you to find me but you think you struck it gold. <laughs> you struck gold I'll tell you the story about San Francisco another time I've never been there personally but somewhere in my dreams maybe I might have been there. I might have visited a few places too. <laughs> That's about as much as I could have done because my travel arrangements were a little delayed. I don't know what airport you might have to fly to or what you had to go through or what podium you had to stand through or what lines you had to stand to. And I don't know if you had back breaking work or you know, you just had to take a seat and say, I'm, I'm done. I'm tired of being on the podium circuit. I'm tired of Tell a lead story. I retire. I'm, I'm burned out. I'm finished. Screw it. Some of us have been there long before we even, and we didn't even, we didn't really do the lead story. All we had to do is watch. But there was a lot of comfort in that, knowing that some of you are still around. Veterans, journalists, important people. Movers and shakers, heavyweights, as we were, as I was told. Some of us just sit there and wonder, are we going to meet that person or not? Maybe if I go to the Clear Channel interview, I'll sit down and have that one-on-one. -on -one, or maybe I'll be in behind the scenes. I don't know where I'll be, but however I got there or wherever we went to or how we found you or how we met one-on-one. -on -one, how we had that talk or whatever backstory, how we found ourselves as a congregation at St. Mattress is a story that has not been told quite yet. We're, we're waiting. But Lord, that you would find a, a, a time where we can do, I think this is like where it comes an adult story, but that's okay. Many of us don't know about enough about sex and Maybe, maybe we need to know more about it. Maybe the church needs to open up and, you know, kind of give us <laughs> the, the big secret. Because I, I was told a few secrets along the way, just re recently by a patient. So I was cleaning up after. Lord Father, you know where we are. You know that a lot of us have to just chuck the past and start over every day. Hopefully we'll always have an opportunity to start out our day 
I like to end my day with humor. I figure, why not try this morning stuff? Like, let's, instead of waiting for the end of the day, why don't I just start in the morning? So however we get that big, we had to sort through a lot of stuff, boxes, between storage units and podiums and getting rid of things and starting with this and dumping this. They call it the story, the big day of the editor calls it dumping. I don't know how I got on this journey because I don't watch a lot of TV, but somehow, some way, I learned on this journey about editorial decisions and things like that, things that normally, it's not part of my repertoire, but I definitely have a box of Wall Street Journal to prove I've been there and did it. Yeah, and including a lot of receipts from storage units, a lot of gas cards, a lot of tokens, easy pass just to get to where I needed to go. I know I had to get to that big story. And it, sometimes a big story is not so big after all. Sometimes a big story is just having a sandwich, a grilled cheese sandwich, and just chilling out, crying a lot because I felt like I messed up big time. Many times I messed up, but I don't ever want to mess up on a big story, especially the big story. The big story is probably not as big as you think. The big story is how do we turn from those things and how do we how do we make this right again? Because that's the big story is the turnaround. They always say that the I want to hear the story of inspiration, the joke, the, the the inside story. That get on the inside, not the beltway, not inside the loop. Which I've been on that loop before, and I could not find my way out of Baltimore one day long ago. But I, and I'm pretty good at navigating my traffic signals too but I've been on that road and so many of you have and I find myself in a really interesting position because normally I'm not one to drive very far or do a lot of talking and that's all I've been doing so I would love to offer that platform to that right person but we're going to tell you a story about St. Maltris the congregation of St. Maltris and I want to be able to share my my heart with you about the funny the downside that some of the things that a lot of people don't get a chance to talk about is the happy ending. I've been wanting to talk about a happy ending. I've mentioned it a few times. Some of us have given way to short answers. and We're not people with short answers, by the way. We like to drag it out, and it's called drama for a reason, so... Without too much more, Lord Father, that you would help us in this performance because I'm fascinated by our theater in a park performance. And right now I'm so excited as we get better and better at our skills and we're getting the fitness and we'll, we'll get a good meal today and we'll be able to create this performing, the performance of a, of a lifetime maybe. I don't know, but it's definitely a performance. And every show and every performance is well, well, let's just say every ticket is worth it every penny of it. Whoever buys a ticket, they really, they're really going to get that lucky. And church play is a church play, but Lord Father, I just pray about the church play and the theater performance and some of the things, the ideas and the creative people that will be behind us and helping us, assist us, and some of the work we've done and where we found some of the items and dumpster diving included. I want to thank God for the dumpster diving because that was the, mo the, the thing that inspired us is the dumpster diving. So, Lord, without too much more, I pray for this performance. I pray that when we get that invite and that you have to, you know, the theater, the theatrical performance. You know the thespians. We're not known for not being, <laughs> well, we're not known for a lot of things. But we're, we're known for one thing. We're drama. We like drama. I was told that lose the drama. So... Maybe I might need to lose a drama. But however it is, we're, we're here to make some people laugh and smile, maybe even cry. I, I hope that performance, while not losing the drama, because to me, Lord Father, it's like t telling a drama queen not to be dramatic. It's like telling the emperor, emperor to wear his clothes. So without too much more, Lord Father, that you would bring us to this point that we could share a great story. A theater performance. I hope it's worth it. 
for every person that gets a ch chair in the in the big arena or gets a special spot every one of those people I thank God that you led them here so without too much more let's get to that performance thank you Jesus for all this we pray in Jesus name amen